breakthrough computer vision AI tech to advance object recognition and more. A multidisciplinary group of researchers from Northeastern have developed a machine that recognizes millions of different colors with the help of breakthrough computer vision AI techniques. It's a major leap within the area of computer vision technology, which is a highly specialized part of the machine learning field with broad applications for a variety of technologies. The machine known as AI is capable of processing and analyzing color more precisely than other previous machines, according to a research paper that outlines the findings published in Materials Today. The capability of machine learning to see color is an increasingly pertinent feature of artificial intelligence as both society and industry in general continue to become more automated. In this age of automation, colors and shapes are features that are the most frequently used for object recognition tasks. This computer vision AI innovation is double-sided, as researchers have been able to create two-dimensional materials with special quantum characteristics, which when incorporated into an optical window to let light enter the machine, allow the device to process a wide range of colors with unparalleled accuracy that was unable to be achieved by computer vision researchers beforehand. Furthermore, AI has the ability to accurately detect and reproduce colors with no deviation from the original spectra, which is due in part to machine learning algorithms created by a group of artificial intelligence, electrical, and computer engineering researchers from a unique partnership between Northeastern's Quantum Materials Lab and Augmented Cognition Lab. The fundamental idea behind the discovery is in the optical and quantum properties of this class of material, which is known as transition metal dichalcogenide. Scientists have long been praising these special materials as having virtually unlimited potential in the areas of electronic, optoelectronic energy storage and sensing applications. This breakthrough computer vision AI is the result of the way that light behaves when it travels through quantum matter. Because these substances are grown on a particular surface, that when sunlight passes through, it results in an electric signal coming out the other end with the sensor, which the researchers can then use as data. When it comes to machine learning computer vision AI applications, there are many industrial use cases, including autonomous vehicles, remote satellite imaging, agricultural sorting, and various other object recognition tasks. The majority of computer vision algorithms recognize colors by breaking them down into red, green, and blue constituent components. It then uses RGB filter information to basically make a guess to reproduce the original color. When you point a digital camera at a color object and snap a picture, the light from the object passes through detectors that have filters in front of them to divide the light into these RGB hues represented by number values. Because of these RGB filters with number values, there are inherent limitations. Instead of using filters, this new computer vision AI technology utilizes transmissive windows comprised of the special two-dimensional material. Instead of splitting the colors into their primary components of red, green, and blue, when colored light is detected, the entirety of the spectral information is used. On top of this, the computer vision researchers are using various techniques to alter and encode them in various ways, which gives them numerical values to recognize the original colors much more uniquely than the traditional RGB filter method. When light enters the windows of the device, it analyzes the color as data with machine learning models that find patterns to identify each color for the device to analyze. This new computer vision AI technique will continue to improve its color perception by adding corrected predictions to its training database. New Superconducting Deep Learning AI Hardware to Perform 100,000 Times Faster Than the Human Brain Scientists have always looked towards human brain power for inspiration to design computing systems, and they have recently taken it even further by creating computer hardware that resembles the brain structure. These neuromorphic computing chips have already demonstrated immense potential for artificial intelligence and machine learning applications, ranging from deep learning to computer vision and more, but they've been using conventional electronic circuits, which has limited their speed and complexity. The problem is that as the chips get bigger and more complex, the signals between their components are as if they are gridlocked and become much slower. The research team at the National Institute of Standards and Technology has presented a solution to this issue, which could enable artificial neural networks to perform tasks 100,000 times faster than human brains. This would give a massive boost to deep learning AI applications, including computer vision, speech recognition, fraud prevention, as well as various other machine learning tasks. Human brain power consists of 86 billion neurons, each of which may be connected to thousands of its neighbors 
known as synapses. Neurons communicate with each other using short electrical impulses known as spikes, with which they produce rich, time-varying patterns that are the foundation of cognition. Neuromorphic chips are electronic components that behave like neurons and send spikes through the human brain-like network, which perform much better for deep learning AI applications than traditional chips. To eliminate conventional electronic communication infrastructure, researchers have created networks using tiny light sources in each neuron that emit optic signals across thousands of connections. This type of neural network can be extremely efficient when superconducting systems are employed to detect small particles of light, also known as photons, which are the tiniest optical signals that can be used to indicate a spike. In a recent Nature Electronics paper, for the first time ever, NIST researchers have created a circuit that functions like a synapse in a biological system, but uses only single photons to send as well as receive signals using superconducting single photon detectors. The calculation within the NIST circuit happens when the single photon detector is connected to the superconducting element in the circuit, which is known as the Josephson junction. The Josephson junction is a combination of superconducting material separated by a thin insulating film. When the current flowing through the sandwich is greater than an amount that is deemed to be the threshold, the Josephson junction starts to generate tiny voltage pulses, referred to as fluxons. When a photon is detected, the single photon detector will push the Josephson junction above the threshold and the fluxons are collected as current within a superconducting loop. Researchers can alter how much current is added to the loop per photon by using a bias on one of the junctions, which is an external current source powering these circuits, also known as the synaptic weight. The ability to alter weights by changing the bias of the Josephson junctions provides a long-term memory function that could be used to program the networks to ensure they can solve various issues. Synapses are an essential part of the brain's computational system. Therefore, this demonstration of single photon synapses with superconductivity is a significant milestone towards achieving the team's entire vision of superconducting optics networks. The next step for the research team is to integrate these synapses with on chip sources of light to demonstrate full superconducting optoelectronic neurons. The team has shown light sources that can be utilized in a complete system, but more research is needed to integrate all components into a single neuromorphic computing chip. In the near future, the synapses can be enhanced using detector materials operating at greater temperatures than the current system. The team is also looking at ways to incorporate synaptic weighting into large-scale neurons. Very soon, the limits of deep learning AI systems could be extended by orders of magnitude and smartphones, computer, cars, and more huge leap in performance. The team has shown light sources that can be utilized in a complete system, but more research is needed to integrate all components into a single neuromorphic computing chip. In the near future, the synapses can be enhanced using detector materials operating at greater temperatures than the current system. The team is also looking at ways to incorporate synaptic weighting into large-scale neurons for deep learning AI systems. By the way, did you know deep learning AI engineers make an average salary of $144,000 per year with bonuses and benefits, all while working remotely? What if you could start learning for free today from world-famous deep learning AI researcher Andrew Ning, the co-founder of Google Brain, to work as a machine learning engineer from home? Well, you can. So get started for free today on Coursera.org with the link below to earn your deep learning AI specialization online at your own pace and join the AI industry where there is a massive shortage of talent that companies are battling for to hire. Click now and start cashing in on the artificial intelligence revolution today.